Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another edition of Fake Camp Commentary. This week we are back in Russia for another Russian death match. This was sent to me exclusively by that man right there, Alex Nabeev, as he is about to take on a guy by the name of Mikhail Nikitin. As you can see him there in the ring, he is a monstrosity of a man. He's a monstrous dude. You can see Alex Nabeev coming out cocky as hell, smoking a cigarette in Alex Nabeev fashion. He's going to crack a beer as well. Right here for the fans in Russia. Again, a Russian death match. There's one other match on the channel, folks. If you're just seeing this randomly, go check that out. Violent death match. This, again, is a violent death match. Um, yeah, it's going to speak for itself probably soon enough as uh, Alex Nabeev is going to get into the ring again, puffing that cigarette. I said it the last time. I'm going to say it again. I feel like if uh, Schlack and Gigi Allen had a baby, you would have this dude right here, Alex Nabeev, who is this time in great shape. Um, he's been clearly working out. He looks like he's ready to go. Taking off the bandana, putting a cigarette out on the middle of his forehead. This dude is insane. One of my favorite wrestlers, quite honestly. Against Nakitin. Mihail Nakitin. Looks like the fans are firmly on the side of Alex Nabeev, the referee, calling for the opening bell here. Yeah, Alex Nabeev getting the fan and fans involved even. He's going to go outside the ring. No, I thought he's going to... He's just getting a little bit of mojo from the crowd. They're just vibing out there, really, folks. Uh, thanks for joining me this week. Fan camp commentary on the air per usual. Uh, in the description, hit the Discord. Hit the Patreon. Do, do me a favor. Get in there. Um, go to the Facebook. Like me on Facebook. And if you haven't subscribed on YouTube already, do that as well. Collar double tie by these two Russians in the middle of the ring. And, you know, I said earlier, Alex Nabeev's been working out, but the guy he's facing right now, right now, this Nikitin, is freaking massive. He has like an old school strongman vibe. Uh, and look to him. Look at him. His upper torso is large as hell. Absolutely massive. Yeah, has that old school like bodybuilder. Um, strongman, like the SPN strongman style. Like he's going to be carrying a boulder and trying to stack it on top of a really hot platform type of vibe. And oh, Alex Nabeev showing off the new torso as well. Look at him. Showing it off, folks. Pulling down the straps. He's ready to go. Inviting Nikitin to do the same, I think. Oh, we've had so far as uh, Karnovo, basically. Testing each other's will first and foremost. And I'm sure I'm not sure if Nikita knows what he's involved with or in store for. Uh, the fans in uh, the deathmatch circles surely know what Alex Nabeev is capable of. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna start this match off with some planks, dueling planks. Who can plank the longest, ladies and gentlemen? Alex Nabeev looking strong and sturdy. Oh, and he definitely won as Nikitin putting the boots to him out of nowhere, and he's putting some strong boots. That's the one thing about these Russian matches, folks. They're brutal as shit. They lay them in very strong style type matches with a taste of absolute violence. As you can see, the larger Nikitin there, Mihail Nikitin. Looks like he's wearing some basic ass tennis shoes, though. I would not say that to his face. Boom! Form smash to Alex Nabeev, a second one. Off the ropes. Irish whip. Big back elbow. Beautifully done by Nikitin. Textbook there, planting Alex Nabeev, who is now on a. You know, I hate to say it this early, but a world of trouble. Again, he's facing an extremely large individual here as he's getting knocked over. We've got a pinfall one, just a one count. Too early for Alex Nabeev to be put away. I don't care who you are or what you look like or what size you are. Alex Nabeev breaking free. Open hand palms to the mid midsection. Form smash, form smash. Three of them, four of them into the corners. We're going to get an Irish whip. They don't even have turnbuckles there, it doesn't look like. Oh, another one nails him. A sixth one. Oh, seventh one. Absolutely laying him in on the Keaton. Bam. And again, a turnbuckleless corner. Oh, big Lariat. And again, Alex Nabeev, known for that Lariat, delivers it. Again, 
showing it off, folks. He's in incredible shape now compared to the last time that I, I personally caught a match of his. Traveling all over Russia, killing it on a regular basis if you follow this guy's career. Nikitin looks like he has a toolbox and uh behind him though, coming off the top rope, it's Nabeev with a big nutter for him smash. He's just gonna deliver a few more to the back. And again, as you can see, a trash can out there with some weapons inside is I don't think that toolbox is gonna do a whole lot to scare Alex Nabeev. We got some mats though. Suplex is nice, and that's that power right there. The new power being shown by Alex Nabeev. He's a large fella he just flipped over there. What's inside this toolbox? Alice Nabeev is going to find out as he just launches it off the forehead. Nothing, but that sucks. Jesus Christ, just throwing that off the head of Nikitin. Got a shovel here. Looks like a classic style snow shovel Nabeev is bringing into the ring. And uh, that thing doesn't look, look too friendly either. Oh, as he gets blocked, I thought he was just going to blast him in the head. And Alex Nabeev, not known for wearing the shoes. Open hand palm strike. As Nikitin's going to turn around, gets blasted in the head with a snow shovel. As it just explodes into the ring. Reminds me of an old New Jack type spot, the way that just exploded. And he is signifying that he is burying Nikitin. One, two, two count. Only a two. Not enough to keep Nikitin down. Jesus Christ. What a brutal strike that was. Again, these Russian death matches, folks. Something else. I know I said it on the last match. I'm going to say it again. What? I mean, a lot of folks will probably know about Alex and Beeb from the famous fire spot, the guitar fire spot in that Russian death match tournament in the woods. Still randomly see that one on as clips. Bringing a barbed wire baseball bat, a nicely wrapped barbed wire baseball bat. He just lost it. He's getting shoulder blocked. Oh, and a nice larry of his own by Nikitin. Oh, and a big chop. And, oh, and a, a second one. I'm not sure if that was just a punch to the chest or a chop. But a barbed wire bat is now laying into the ring, and I'm not sure if Nikitin even saw, have even seen that there. Off the ropes. Oh, big foot to the face. Almost set a big boot. But again, not known for wearing the shoes. And another one, just a high kick. Caught him with the toes, and that was enough to get him wobbly to enter that DDT, which he planted into the ring and picking up the barbed wire baseball bat. Alex Nabeev, he's going to try to go in, as I would imagine on the forehead. Yes, just going to dig it in to Mihail Nikitin. And we're going to have juice here, folks, any minute. The referee's in there, too, to make sure he's not giving up, I guess. Again, no rules in this match, as you can clearly see. And he's pulling back on the neck. And yeah, we got him opened up, folks. The juice is flowing. Bloody. The Crimson Mask. Alex Nabeev getting in there, making sure it's to his liking. As he's going to be spilling blood right here on this canvas. And the referee again in there. Ball over the back with a barbed wire baseball bat. That was awesome. Nailed him. Swinging that thing like a big dick. I'm in a second one and raking it across the lower back and a third time. Jesus Christ. The violence has picked up a couple of notches here. As you can see the ripped shirt. That is not bullshit barbed wire. Senton bomb hurting himself with the barbed wire bat on the back of Nikitin. As you can see, Alex, Alex and Weave will do damage to his own body. Does not care. Crazy as hell. We got a pin. One, two, two count. Alex Nabeev, not enough to keep this big fellow down again. Large as fuck. Bloody as hell now, too. Wrist control by Alex Nabeev, getting him up off the mat. And as you can see, Nikita, I think he was trying to get that barbar bat out of there. It's done the most damage of this match, but we got a pump handle slam in the works. Back elbow, back elbow. Oh, and he nailed him right into the head there. And he gets enough to break free. Misses a clothesline off the... Oh, shoots him off the other side. Oh, and he nails him that time with a huge lariat. Showing the power there and taking Alex Nabeev clearly off his feet and flipped him inside out, actually. If he can get a pin here, that, that could. I'm not sure if he's going to have enough to beat him. No, putting the boots to him, it's not over yet. A little too late to follow up with a, with a quick pin anyways. Mihail going outside the ring. What's he going to find? 
What else is under that ring? Of, of the Russian rings? What is that? Is it just a brick? I think he just threw a large ass cinder block into the ring, if I'm not mistaken. I think that's what that is. Is now he's going to bring Alex Nabeev's head and face over to that. You never want to see that. Is he. Oh, man. Okay. He is just ramming his head repeatedly into that cinder block. As he is also a bloody mess. He's trying to pay. Nabeev back here as a receipt, but Jesus Christ, referee, get the brick out of the ring. Again, as you can see, no rules. Violent Russian deathmatch. Again, exclusively brought to you by Fan Cam Commentary. Thanks to Alex Nabeev. I can't thank him enough as he is now busted wide open. Thanks to having his head repeatedly ran into that cinder block. Jesus Christ, the violence so far. Big scoop slam, and he's just going to plant him right on that. Jesus, the edge is right into the lower back. Oh, my God. Brutal, brutal bump there by Alex Nabeev. We're going to get a cover. One, two, two count. Getting his shoulder up. Alex Nabeev is still in this thing. My God. I don't know what was worse, the head being repeatedly thrown into the cinder block or the scoop slam. And the way his back landed on that thing. If you mess up your spine, you're not going to be able to do anything. And that's that's a weird weapon. Looks like possibly some light tubes in there. Not sure if that's a fluorescent light just completely intact. See some keyboards, a kendo stick, and a trash can. My God, though. And Keaton come back into the ring here. He's going to have to follow up. And now a bloody mess. And Alex and beat both men covered in blood and he's got the trash can and i'm not sorry he's gonna put an alex and even alex nabeev excuse me inside the trash can and he's just gonna fuck no oh god he just blasted him right in the head with that cinder block while the trash can was over the body and head of nabeev my god and just bleeding profusely on the mat a good close-up there great camera work Getting right in there, big forearm smash to the back, and he's going to put him back inside the trash can. That is not where you want to be because you can't see anything your opponent's going to do to you, and he's going to try a gut wrench right now. Oh, and he now he just tossed him, and unlucky for Alex Nabib, he sort of landed on the barbed wire baseball bat as well. One, two, two count. Again, getting his feet up and grabbing the ropes, clutching onto the ropes, but he did aggressively get his shoulder up as well. Alex, Alex Nabib is still in this thing. It takes a lot to beat Alex Nabeev. Both men bleeding profusely. At this point, Alex Nabeev's been in trouble for a, a minute. Nikitin now reigning for him smashes of his own. You can see they're a little bit weaker than before. Both men are getting gassed at this point, but got him firmly into the corner. We're going to get another Irish whip. Reversed. Oh, and he landed into the second turnbuckle. And again, there's no turnbuckles there. Face first into just metal and steel that's holding this ring together, essentially. And now Nabeev's got that fluorescent... I don't even know if you want to call that a bundle. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's literally just what you would hang on the ceiling and just demolish it and breaks it in half over Nikitin's head. Wow. An explosion in the middle of the ring. Now there's just shards of glass everywhere. Nabeev bringing in the kendo stick to follow up, and he's... Oh, yeah! Across the back of Mihail. Crowd still firmly, I think, behind Nabeev, and a second one long ways. One thing you do not want to get just... I mean, I, I, you know, there's a lot of crazy weapons. We've seen, of course, cinder blocks and barbed wire in this match, but the freaking kendo stick... Oh, God. Brutal headbutt right to the side of the head. Maybe even possibly the eye. And he just demolished him with that into a white Russian life sweep. Ah, the Sandman. And we got to cover. One, two, two count again. Not enough to keep Nikitin down. Now Alex Dabeev. Picking up the cinder block, laying it into the middle. Blood all over that cinder block. His own blood from being completely busted open. 
But he's setting it up for something of his own. He's going to try to suplex, and we've seen that he can do it. Oh, God, yes. Nailed the cinder block. What a brutal suplex. One, two. Oh, two count again. Not enough. Not enough. What is it going to take to put either man away at this point? This is a great death match. American, Japanese, Russian, whatever. This is a great death match. Double head chops across the back. Nabeev going and getting the trash can at this point. I wasn't sure what he was going to pick up there. Oh, he nails him right in the head. Across the back. Now demolishing the trash can on the body of Miael. Oh, again, a third one. Almost tripping over the cinder block behind him. Got to be a little bit wobbly and woozy just from the blood loss. Now setting up the trash can, and now it's been bent so much, it's just sharp edges. If one thing I could recommend going and checking out is Alex Nabeev's promos. Some of the best promos in wrestling right now. Again, love this dude. He's going to he set up a trash can. He's running across. Big drop kick into the body. And again, that trash can, as you can see right there, has been bent and destroyed and is really just sharp edges. And those going right into the stomach and midsection of Nikitin. And he's got another center block. Well, we don't need another center block. Jesus, Alex. A second center block has now been in a sledgehammer. Okay. Picking. Uh, how do you amp it up another level? He somehow did it. He's going to set up a center block. Okay, yeah. Look how large they are, though. Not only onto the crotch, but on, like, the entire torso. And he's going to smash it. Sledgehammer. Jesus Christ. That's gone again. He's raining down blows. Oh, my God. I didn't even have to commentate there. The scream alone. That could be it. That is, ladies and gentlemen, one, two, three. The winner of this match, Alex Nabeev. Holy crap. In the record books, it's going to come down. Winner by Sledgehammer Smash on cinder blocks across torso. Twice he rained down blows. What a match. Again, thank you, Alex Devee, for giving me this match uh, to drop exclusively here in the United States. Uh, again, can't thank you enough. Keep doing what you're doing. You're killing it, man. Um, yeah, anybody, again, hit the Discord in the description. Hit the Patreon. Uh, hit the Facebook. Hit the TikTok. I always doing little little mini docs that aren't anywhere else on TikTok um, from shoot interviews with dudes. But uh, then I'll, every Saturday I'm going to be streaming live. At least I'm going to try to keep that promise. Uh, usually probably later in the evening or nighttime. But yeah, drop by, and um, oh yeah, Alex Dubiv picking up the victory, and the fans giving him some love. Snake so Keaton is going to be pulled out of the ring. Great matchup. Yeah, thanks again, folks. I will uh, see you next time.